Hey, Jim Deacons here, Crossroads Auction Service, just giving you another update on the progress for our big May 13th sale. Starts at 9 a.m. We're gonna start out with all this lumber, two by sixes, two by fours, plywood, pine interior doors, T111 over there. We got a ton of it, even some great rough cut in there. We got great, what's that, insulation back there. Great barn door sliders back there. Barn door sliders back there. Tons and tons of plywood. Great uh, exterior doors. Look at them, all leaded in there. Folks, plus we have kitchen cabinet sets. I think we have over 10 kitchen cabinet sets. We also have great uh, vinyl waterproof flooring. We have tile, tons of brand new accessories. Uh, we have DeWalt, Makita, we have faucets all the building materials you could possibly need starting at starting at uh, the lumber starts at 9 a.m. lumber starts at 9 a.m. and then we're gonna split up the two auctioneers one auctioneer is gonna come through here we got all the metal racking look at all the garden stuff we got garden planters right there the arches the windmills right there you got the uh, more arches and more planters over here slow up for a minute Kevin you got pontoon boats, folks. All these pontoon boats came out of a marina in Indian Lake. We brought them all here. Uh, the gentleman retired. As they sold off the marina, we took all the inventory, brought it here to be sold. All these boats, pontoon boats, all came out of, uh, out of Indian Lake Marina. Plus, we have more planters. Come on down. Go ahead, Kevin. We have several pontoon boats. I think that's a 26er. That's a 24-foot party barge. We got riding lawnmowers, John Deere, Husqvarna, Zero Turn Errands. These boats back here, them are 16 and 14 footers. We have all the paperwork for the V bottoms also. There's more flower baskets right there, or there's another pontoon boat. Again, these got uh, what, 20, 25 registrations on them. There's a Husqvarna right there, Husqvarna rider. In the back is two Yamaha outboard 24, uh, 25 horse outboard motors. There's more V-bottoms. I don't know how many V-bottoms we got here, Josh, but we got a lot. 20, not, a lot well, I got over 10 of them, I know that. Hey, there's the old Puma snowmobile, that's going. There's another pontoon boat that'll be in there. Another pontoon boat. More planters. Look at all the metal planters in there. That's heavy duty iron planters, folks. That's the heavy duty stuff. There's another riding lawnmower. Here's a brand spanking new dock right here. Brand new, never been installed. All the hardware is there for it, all the decking for it, all the poles are for it. It's got the boat poles too, keep moving. Got the boat poles in there. Now folks, you look right back here. Hold up, Kevin. All right, these are just the beginning of our outboard motors right here. 9.9 .9 Yamahas, Mercury's in there. We got them all, and again, came right out of the marina. They were all set up in the marina. We got a bunch of them we're going to be selling. Short shaft, long shaft, all right out of the marina. If you look in the back, there's some more V-bottoms back there. Again, we got 14 to 16 foot aluminum V-bottoms, and we have all the paperwork for them. There's another pontoon boat right there. I think that's a 26 footer, 26 footer right there. And more of your garden stuff. Look at all the garden planters right there. Really nice. There's some more V-bottoms. That one's with a steering wheel and a motor right there. <coughs> there's another pontoon boat. And again, there's the outboards right there. Again, short shaft, long shaft, eight horses, 9.9s. We got some 25 horses out there. And we still have more up around the other way. Here's uh, some brand, these are close to brand spanking new pontoon trailers. I think one's a 24 footer, one's a 26 footer. And there's another one somewhere. Yep, we'll be selling them. Now, folks, remember, this is Saturday. Saturday, May 13th. Hold up a minute, Kevin. Saturday, May 13th, we start at 9 a.m. We'll have two auctioneers going. We'll start out with the lumber, and then we jump right on the pontoon boats, the boat motors, and all that. Right here, folks, boy, a really, really nice mini excavator. Thing runs out 100%, well kept. Super, super machine right there. Really is, you need an excavator, you're gonna to wanna to be here for that sale. That thing's a sweetheart. You got a nice dump trailer right there next to it. Boy, close to brand new Husqvarna Zero Turn right there. 
close to brand new. Low hours on that one. Go ahead, Kevin. Got a nice Kubota with the cab. Tractor back there. I think that, if I remember right, that's a 45 horse maybe. I don't quite remember. But it's got the cab and everything on it. You got the six-seater side-by-side uh, -side John Deere. Them are big money. Very well kept. Runs 100%. Great, great machine right there. There's some more V-bottoms. I think these are all 14-footers right there. All right, here's another Cub Cadet. I, this has got less than 100 hours on it. Less than 100 hours, Cub Cadet, zero turn. Close to brand new as you're going to find right there. Really, really nice mower. Back there, we got a New Holland Skidster. Runs and drives, does everything it's got to do. It's a New Holland Skidster. That'll be in the sale. Now, folks, we're also showing you in the order that we'll be selling it, all right? We're going to start right out of the gate after this stuff. We're not messing around. Boy, there's a really nice, that's all metal, folks. That's a grill slash smoker. You can see there's smoke with it. Actually, the smoke comes right out of its nostrils in the front, Josh. Or you can uh, grill with it. That's really cool. Fantastic sheds back there. Look at them sheds. Really, that smart siding on that, right? This has got... Uh, uh, waterproof floor in it. It's got the metal roof on it, double doors. It's a soup. It's got the ramp with it. I think that, Josh, we measured that out yesterday. What was that? You remember? I think it was uh, 18. 18 wide and something deep. Fantastic shed, though. Right there is a Mahendra. Again, close to new as you're going to get. People downsizing, didn't need it around the house anymore. It was 12 by 8. 12 by 8 the shed is? 12 by 8, Josh says. All right, the uh, Mahendra, that's a great compact tractor right there, folks. It broke their hearts to get rid of it. They just uh, downsized and sold the house, didn't need it anymore. That is a fantastic Mahendra tractor right there. There's another one of them grills. You got the uh, cut, you got the brush hog right there. You got the Aaron's rototiller in there. Another nice shed. Again, folks, these sheds are quality. They're really, really well built. That's all kiln dried. Really, really nice sheds. You got, what else we got here, Josh? Oh, you got the forks. You got the fork attachments right there. You got the nice enclosed trailer, super enclosed trailer right there. You got the post hole, brand new post hole digger right there. And the gra the log snatch right there. Right, both brand spanking new. Go ahead, Kevin. All right, got another nice open trailer back there with the drop down gate. More of your forks in there. There's a John Deere Gator, six by four. Dave's been using it out here, actually. He's got it set up like the ice cream shop there, a little umbrella on it. But yeah, that's going into sale. All runs, drives, does everything it's got to do. Got a break, yep, got the doors and heat with that, Josh. Doors and heat with that. Gator, six by four. Back there, you got a brand new Skidster brush hog back there. That's going, it's brand spanking new. If you buy that, make sure you put oil in it. It's brand new, doesn't have any gear oil in it. It's brand new. Back there, you got aluminum trailer, it looks like. Drop down gates on it with the two John Deere signs on there. You got the uh, TYM, TYM tractor, 45 horse with the backhoe right there. Again, you need a tractor, you're going to want to be here. You got the spreader, you got the skidster plates right there. All right, what else we got over there, Josh? Uh, Firebird? You got the Firebird in there, runs and drives, does everything it's got to do. You got the Massey Ferguson. What a sweetheart of a little tractor that is. Super, super clean Massey Ferguson. That thing is clean and ready to go. You got the dump, the, uh, dump box back there, Josh. That's going. You got the Chevy pickup with the plow. That's a pretty cool truck there in the back. That's a four-door Chevy. Uh, Josh, you figure out it's a half ton? I believe it's a half ton. Half ton truck. 1999. 1999. 80,000 miles, 80, miles. It's clean. Really nice Ford dump truck back there. Again, I think that's a 97. I think Kevin told 95. me. 95 with uh, 17,000 miles. 17,000 original miles. 17,000 original miles, and that thing is clean. Runs like a dream, a and it dumps. All right, in here we got two mini excavators right there. Great for close work. Both of them are brand spanking new also. Mini excavators, they're going. You got the corral right there. Them are 12 foot length gates on them. I think we said we had 10 of them, Josh. Ten, yep. So I added up to 125 feet of corral right there. 125 feet of corral the with the gate. 
Plus we have the other gates right here. We have 16 foot gates, 12 foot gates, 10 foot gates, and eight foot gates, I do believe. 16, and 14, 12, and 10. I was close, I was close. Back here in the back, I got two containers. Them are sweet too. Uh, they're 20 foot, 20 foot long. They're eight, I think eight foot, six inches wide, double doors, very well kept, all dry kept. Uh, really, really nice containers. Josh, we'll just walk up to the front. Got a nice open bow boat back there, all ready to go. We got a group of cars back there, folks, all different kinds back there, from Kias, Fords, Nissan, Chevy pickups, Jeeps. We'll be selling all that. You got the player side by side right there. You got two other boats in the back. You got the big metal gates over there. Go ahead, Kevin, you can back up. Got a brand spanking new car lift right there. Hang on, Josh and I are trying not to fall. Brand spanking new car lift right there. It's never been used, it's brand new. You get up in here, take a look at this, folks. We got some great play toys, four wheelers in there. Little single, uh, what do they call them, a razor, Josh? I guess so. Yeah, little razor. Got the uh, Ranger in there, you got a Polaris Sportsman in there, you got more Polaris four, uh, four wheelers. These are really nice. This Polaris 850 and a Polaris 750. The folks bought a side by side and uh, said they didn't need them anymore. They all run out 100%. Great running machines. Folks, then we have all these riding lawnmowers, all been serviced, ready to put to work. Every one of these have been serviced and ready to go. We also got the Polaris 800 snowmobile in there. That's the assault. You got go-karts down in here. You got the sweepers in here. Even got the old Yamaha, the old Yamaha three-wheeler back there. Runs like a dream. Now, if Josh can show you, hang on, Kevin. Zoom right in on the front porch there, Josh. Up on my front porch, I have more outboard motors, 20 horses, 30 horses in there, 9.9s. All in the back, I got air compressors in there, generators in there, uh, pipe threaders in there, brand new doors in there, tons and tons of accessories all down the front porch right there. Great Loaded. generators. Yeah, great generators. Propane, gas, both brand new. Great metal signs for decorating all the way through there, Power, powered by Ford, Dr. Pepper, Coca-Cola, all that metal will go. Go ahead, Kevin. John Deere's right here. Look at all the John Deere's we got. Troy built zero turns in there. More go-karts back there. Folks, here's a fantastic Harley Davidson motorcycle. I get the privilege of moving that every morning. That thing is 100% super custom. Even the dipstick looks like a knife, doesn't it, Josh? Yeah, it does. Yeah, that thing is absolutely gorgeous. If you're looking to upgrade or you want one, folks, be here for the sale on May 13th. That thing is a sweetheart. Runs fantastic, looks even better. I'll tell you, that is a bike to have right there. We got your 1956 Dodge right there. Again, all runs out, everything works on it. Nice, nice car right there. That's a 1956 Dodge. We'll be selling that. Also on our sale on May 13th. And then we have, in my opinion, one of the stars of the show right here, 19. 57 Chevy pickup truck, as right as rain as it can be. Motor's been rebuilt, interior is excellent. If you ever wanted one, get to the sale for that. That thing is a sweetheart, runs 100%, been rebuilt, redone. That thing's an absolute gorgeous, gorgeous. Again, gentleman sold his home. They're moving to Florida permanently. He had a tear in his eye when he dropped that off but he said he just can't take it with him. But I tell you what, you ever wanted one, be here for the sale. That thing there, you can't take nothing from it. Absolutely beautiful piece of machinery right there. And then folks, as you can see, we got our typical yard stuff. All our yard filler stuff, golf carts in there. Golf carts are runner. Yeah, golf carts in there, more uh, lawn mowers, all that kind of stuff. Just all our yard filler stuff, lawn carts, lumber, uh, ambles down in there, all of our stuff right there. So folks, this sale, go ahead, Kevin, you can stop. So the folks, this sale starts 9 a.m. sharp on May 13th. The yard is loaded. We did barely showed you everything we got. Big sale, don't make a mistake, Saturday, May 13th. That's when it starts. Gonna be two auctioneers at once. 9 
9 a.m. 9 a.m. sharp with uh, two auctioneers. You can come down Friday the 12th and preview from noon to 5. You can come down Friday from noon to 5 on the 12th. Preview. The boys will be here with the keys. Fire it up. Check it out. You can get your bid card early, which I strongly suggest to do that. Come down Friday. Pick out what you want. Let the boys fire it up. You can check it out, out, whether it be a tractor, the mini excavator, the trucks, whatever. Get your footing underneath you. Know what you want to do. And then uh, get your pre, get your number ahead of time. That way, when you come in Saturday, you're all ready to go and you got it all picked out. So we have preview Friday, May 12th from noon to 5. And then the big sale starts on May 13th at 9 a.m. Two auctioneers at once. And don't forget, you need kitchen cabinets, lumber, you need flooring, tile, faucets, any of the building accessories. We have it here, and it's all brand new. Really, really nice lineup. We'll probably do a video later on of all the building materials and show you all of that. So, folks, don't forget, May 13th, Saturday, 9 a.m., be there.